Hello and welcome to Video Jug. We're going to show you how to make crispy whiting with brown butter caper tomato sauce. You will need the following ingredients to serve four people. Four 200 gram whiting fillets, 150 grams of plain flour, two eggs, lightly beaten, 200 grams of breadcrumbs, salt and pepper, and vegetable oil. And for the sauce, 70 grams of butter, 1 tablespoon of capers, the juice of half a lemon, 2 tomatoes, 1 tablespoon of chopped parsley, and salt and pepper to season. You will also need a bowl of iced water. And you will also need these utensils. Two dinner plates or trays, a large frying pan, a metal spatula, a small sharp knife, two bowls, a small saucepan, a large saucepan, a spoon, a paper towel, a slotted spoon, and a cutting board. The tomatoes we use in the sauce need to be peeled and de-seeded. First, remove the core of the tomato with a sharp knife, like this. Then turn over the tomato and make a small cross on the bottom. Repeat the same process with the other tomato. Step 2. Have a bowl of boiling salted water ready and put in the tomatoes. Leave them there until the peel comes off by itself, about 10 seconds. Step 3. When the skin has loosened itself from both tomatoes, place them directly into iced water and leave for about a minute. Then peel them. Step 4. Cut the tomatoes into quarters. Scoop out the seeds. and dice. And there you have two perfectly peeled and de-seeded and diced tomatoes. Step 5. Now, moving on to the fish. We start by placing the flour onto a tray and seasoning it with salt and pepper. Step 6. Make sure that the fillets are all completely dry before starting the breadcrumbing process. Start by lightly dusting them in the flour. Step 7. Next, bathe each of the fillets rapidly in the beaten egg and then coat each fillet with breadcrumbs, pressing them into the surface to make sure they stick. Step 8. Heat the oil. Heat about half a centimetre of vegetable oil in a large frying pan. Although we aren't going to deep fry the fish, you need to be generous with the oil for the breadcrumb coating to turn out just right. Step 9. When the oil is very hot, add two of the fillets and fry one side until golden brown. Flip them over and fry the other side for a further minute then remove. Step 10. Repeat the same process for the other two fillets, making sure that the oil stays very hot. Step 11. To prepare the sauce, start by placing a small frying pan over a high temperature to heat up. Step 12. Once the pan is hot, add the butter and leave it to heat sufficiently until it foams. Step 13. When the foaming of the butter subsides and it turns brown, then take the pan off the heat. Here we add the other ingredients. The capers, the lemon juice, and the cubed tomatoes, and of course the parsley.
Season the sauce with salt and pepper and stir well. It is now ready to serve. Step 14. Now all that remains is to serve the crispy whiting fillets topped with a caper sauce or if you prefer, you can put the sauce into a serving jug for people to help themselves. And that is how to make crispy whiting with brown butter caper tomato sauce.